the basic strokes for the um, official script for the horizontal one, right? Here, horizontal, and also here some um, vertical and the slant. So I want to show you and uh, explain, and uh, we learn by doing, talked about um, one, like a flying, a uh, goose tail flying stroke, right? We saw, we, we, we saw here at the handout, one flying and the other, always, you know, heel, uh, I mean, um, conceal the, the, the tip at the, at the very first, and then go. So two end doesn't really show the, like a dog bone thing, a two big bob thing. Okay, for the dot, same way to do heel, uh, I mean, conceal the tip and then, you know, unfocused, oh, thank you. And then the other, other dot. So like, a, you know, back a little bit and then do that. And then the big horizontal one we learned already, but notice very connect, you know, touch the two dots, notice it. Hide the tip and then go press, press, press more. And then consistency lift, lift, you know, the goose tail. Flying, do that. Okay, and then the slant part different from standard style. Same way to do like the vertical thing Look at that, you know, back a little bit to hide the tip, okay? And then you go at the end, not sweeping, you know, just to go there and gradually lift, just, just lift, do that. And then touch the, to do the horizontal one. Same way, but do not show the tail thing, flying thing. <laughs> and then um, for the, uh, I mean, turning part, like start another uh, stroke, not very, um, we do not do the, uh, any uh, like a skill for the continue for the folding one or like uh, uh, the standard style. It's just to start another stroke but connect, okay. So same way to do like the um, uh, hide the tip, okay. And then back start. And then lift. Two horizontal one in center. Touched. Touch. And the right part for this, do the vertical first. And then actually um, another vertical and the hook, but in this style, you know, the carving thing, better you connect it. So, uh, a little bit like it shows the tendency things normally we do like that right but start here you know after this vertical and something here and then connect to i mean even connect these these things back here see that and the hook just because it's on stone or on the metal thing, you know. And then horizontal again and connect. And start all.
milk. I didn't do anything. Oh, okay. Can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. I don't know what happened. And then the slant part. Notice that the hide, hide, the hide, the hide tip and the connect with other stroke and the start even light, lighter. I mean, at the end, even a little bit, uh, not sweeping out, you know, something like the bounced to the, to the end, you know, put power there. Look at it, look at it. Oh, and then just lift to that. Okay, the things um, talked about connect. Um, the reason is you, you know, on the hard surface like the stone or the metal thing, when you use knife to carve, to carve, very, very uh, hard to keep some a little, little space and there. Are, Understand that when we do the standard, standard, right? This, this, this thing, cut thing. Okay, that's back to the, 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 the standard. Better we do the, uh, I mean, by comparison, this is the cut, the thing, yeah. Two dots. And this is also connected. But you don't have to, as we learned. And uh, okay, this one. See, those two um, strokes not connected. The hook here. And uh, the upper part um, and the, the uh, lower part, see here, turning part. Lower part and the upper part not connected. And the slant part, not rounded, that heavy one at the end, but you know, kind of sweeping. <laughs> so this is on paper. The standard is on paper. And this one talking about the seal, uh, I mean, official uh, script is on the, you know, hard, 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 hard not the paper. Mm, thinking about the, the stick right on the sand or the uh, knife carve on the stone part. So um, very uh, much easier if you put them like more connect. <laughs> if you need a little bit of space, you want to save a little bit of space. When you carve, it's very hard. <laughs> and also um, do the very rounded, rounded this kind of heavy uh, end. It's easier uh, and do this sweeping part not 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 easy. It it won't uh, won't work on the um, on the stone uh, if you do sweep in the stroke, right? Uh, and uh, uh, for the whole image, my this one actually is too kind of too long. Should be look at the sample. Look at the sample, it should be very uh, more um, flattened. Look at, uh, yeah. Right, more flattened. So uh, you can do very kind of a short uh, two dots just indicated the dots and the big to connect the big, the small, uh, I mean the um, 
goose tail one indicate this style. And that do things very flatten. And this actually um, stroke by stroke, I think is even easier because on the standard style and the walking style things, you thinking about not lots of lots of connection. See, this is even more connect more connect on the sample. Thinking of, um, I mean, using knife to carve. So sometimes it a little bit, you know, shows more power, but not very neat. Probably is just okay. As it's supposed to be. That's we called like the um, metal stone uh, flavor. Flavor shows. You know, just like back a little back, like back a little bit this way or or this way, someplace, and then lift it. You know, that's what shows um, some some places. Yeah, very strong, stable, not very neat, but with some uh, like a literary painting. Sometimes uh, says the calligraphy need to show the yeah, Jing Shi Wei. Jing means metal, metal stone things. Which means no, uh, not on the paper, not on paper. You know what's the metal stone flavor? Metal stone flavor means um, you know kind of looks a little bit not very um, okay in writing. Which means no, no, very light sweeping stroke. Just remember that because the sweeping stroke won't show anything, won't work on the uh, stone or metal. <laughs> Yeah, but sometimes like the, with the plum painting uh, or with some uh, things, we want to show uh, some uh, stroke characters with this, uh, with this character. Um, shows the plum is very uh, tough or sometimes, you know, the uh, landscape painting very like the mountain or a stone, very stable, they are heavy looking uh, or sometimes the meaning very uh, dignified things. Uh, anyway, that's uh, uh, continue to the explain something like the uh, this style official script. And let's look at the um, standard style um, and then uh, for the, the cut one. Uh, actually, I want to explain. So the the characters upper part mm, we can learn is the other character for this part. This part. Oh, very thick my ink. The bottom of the ink. Very dry. So this is the other meaning. I mean, it's the other characters, two characters here. This is the character for on the front or forward, forward. This is the front, this is the front. And uh, the lower part, this is knife. So put them together as a scissors. Um, yeah. So like a knife, but in the front, front is knife, because <laughs> the the back the back one is the handle, right? So this is a scissors. <laughs> Makes sense to remember to remember it. 
um, and also indicated that you know the the for uh, the tree cut the clip. Uh, we also like that. Uh, we we also do that, and uh, um, that's uh, the two characters. And that's learned the uh, um, walking walking style. Walking style. There are some rules for that, and also uh, we use as um, other characters. So for the upper part, if walking walking uh, style. See two dots, and connect with the horizontal two dots, and content continuous tendency with the horizontal one, and the the moon one and the center one become one character and for this to connect, right? And then no room for the knife. So very, um, yeah, also this one is the moon, right? We learned before. When do walking style become faster? What do you do? Like the horizontal one, I um, mean slant one for that, and the back to do one stroke, like a circle one, for the things in, indicate the things in the center. Okay, just like that. So the upper part become the front, the character front, the front. Just become two dots and then make sense, huh? Because you see in other character, we will use the, the uh, again for the moon part or for the whole things like front part of the characters, mm -hmm. and the the uh, lower part, the knife part, uh, actually doesn't change that much. So put them together. Okay, the grass style I didn't choose here because um, for normal Chinese people, people uh, even didn't recognize, recognize that it's very um, grass or very far from the basic thing. I think uh, sometimes um, I choose the, um, I just ignore that, omit that. I do not want to go, uh, I mean, to I mean, the, the, the weird <laughs> branch of the writing things. Yeah, this is, I think is fast enough and very common for the walking style. And uh, instead I choose the uh, official style. So give you three styles, but instead um, grass style, I give you the um, script, uh, uh, official script to practice and uh, we learn some other strokes and also for um, like a branch of the um, plum we are going to put together uh, to write. It's very, the, uh, very famous uh, and common uh, for the um, plum painting, you know, a bunch of, uh, a bunch of, cause the cut uh, a bunch of the, um, plum flower, blossom branch. That's very common term, famous term for the literary painting in the uh, like calligraphy style. And people want to show the, the tough branch of the plum. Um, and I think this kind of the um, good choice. So we learn this script for script, uh, official script for these characters for the cut thing. Okay, let's do the uh, plum uh, for, uh, we learned the three styles already um, practice and also same reason for the plum, very early, very tough um, and it shows lots of no leaf, only branch. So this style, I think a little bit, you know, we could talk about the, the uh, stone, uh, metal stone flavor of the writing um, kind of a match matched this kind of shows lots of, you know, power, um, power and uh, the, the chi things. Mm -hmm. 
And uh, what about uh, your feeling about the uh, writing of uh, um, the um, the plum characters? Uh, is is that is that a hard hard one? Yeah, unmute yourself. Talk about that. I I learned. Kathy said um, uh, just like the um, cursive writing of the. Uh, plum character. It, it is very different. Uh, I, I I like like that too. Looks like the you know the um, um, the bottle thing. You know a little bit rounded thing, and it's even easier to write. Standard is very hard <laughs> to very, write. It. Very difficult to. Yeah. No matter how much I tried, it just yes. I kept thinking, okay, I'm gonna slant it this way or that way, and it just wouldn't go. Right, right, right. It's yeah, not really square. Tight. It's not not a square. Yeah, but it's, it's not straight, but it's right. not. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Very hard to write. Write it to please your eye, right? Yeah. <laughs> to, right to get you know the balancing looking and the beautiful. It's very hard. No, I mean, I mean, not strange, not strange, not strange. For for common people, for Chinese people, uh, we all consider. You know, for even for the um, the master, consider this is very challenging, <laughs> challenging um, character, yeah. character for that. But you know, try the um, the um, this one. Try the um, official script one, because it's one one character. I mean, one stroke by one stroke. You know, and you look. Um, uh, how to say? Uh, I I don't want to say not fluent. <laughs> you don't have to try that. You know, you know, one by one, like you 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 put some you know stick together. You know, um, and one by one, you try to you know pus puzzle the puzzle them, and probably easier. I I think it's easier. Yeah, try try it, try it. Yeah, and the uh, whole um wood radical, right? Wood radical. Same way to do, you know, hide the, uh, the the tip and do not do the dark bone thing and just go thinking about, you know, on stone, on stone carving, you know, just go straight, go straight, do not think uh, on paper, yeah, and the lift, right? And the connect, but not very clear, see that? A little bit just shows, because on stone, you carve, it's very hard, yeah. A hard surface. You you are using knife, okay, and then down, and gradually just the lift. And this vert, this uh, uh, I mean the vertical one is kind of lean right, right? Okay, and do the slant, connect. And the dot. See, uh, they are all very connected, right? And the not sh very shows the um, very um, shows individual. Mm -hmm. Okay, and uh, you know the one stroke uh, on the right, right one st one stroke like the dot thing, a slanted thing over the. Uh, over, over the horizontal one, right? Actually shows a little bit, you know, on the carving, probably they do the horizontal first, you know, thinking about that way. So the dot uh, like stick out a little bit and then actually the very heavy for the uh, horizontal one. I, as I said, carving, they probably do the horizontal one first, you know? like that. And then very heavy um, for the vertical one here, carving. You know, and put each stick together <laughs> and the, you know, carving thing and you do the horizontal, horizon, horizontal one. Actually, I did the wrong order. This first, 
And this, anyway, stick by, uh, I mean, uh, stick by, uh, stroke by stroke, it doesn't matter. When you carve, I'm thinking of carving. See this part, turning part, want to show um, more two strokes separated, okay? You can put them together for carving easier, but want to show you this is two strokes, not the turning part together, consistent. Okay, and then remember one flying, you know, one, uh, only one stroke horizontal one with the goose tail flying. So here is the one, like a dominant stroke, only always one stroke dominant, right? So you can do very, very over, um, for showy, for one stroke, for this um, style script, uh, uh, official script. And the two dots, see, connected to the other, this one, conduct them. Just remember when you're carving, you do them connect very, uh, very uh, easy to do. And you leave, if you leave space there, uh, like the island, very hard <laughs> to do when you do carving. And uh, honest, make, make sense? That's why it become this style. And you see the whole thing, the whole thing um, put together, eventually you judge it. Um, I think it's, it's easier. Did you feel that you try that one? It's easier to um, arrange the bal balancing things for the whole thing. Um, I don't know why, because of right slower and also because of the stroke by stroke, you have chance to, you know, ar arrange them. And uh, uh, the whole flavor shows, uh, it's supposed to be kind of a, mm, uh, not very fast looking thing, you know, uh, on stone and slow on, um, you know, this kind of things. <laughs> um, I don't know. You, you try. I tried. I think it's um, it's it's, it's even um, easier easier for um, standard style, because standard style shows lots of uh, um, fluency and um, on the on the paper on the paper you need to be. This is even easier because stroke by stroke, uh, you know you, you want to do and you have chance to. Um, to put the things where you want. Sometimes, you know, when through the one stroke, oh, where it goes, I, I, I have no chance, no time, you know, it changes. I have to do, you know, lots of things, just try it. And I like um, the, the looking of the um, uh, stone, uh, stone, metal stone flavor thing for um, some, um, as I said, even the image of one, uh, I mean, one character image or with some meaning of like a gentleman, you know, <laughs> the tough uh, and for the plum branch thing, uh, early, early spring, not very, um, you know, the sweet looking thing, probably you want this kind of the um, metal stone looking. Mm -hmm. You can do um, even um, this character is also very hard, and you can do more like the um, practice with the like last time we do lots of horizontal one, right? The horizontal one is the very um, we said the, the typical one for doing that. Um, when you do once one flying, you can do even a very over, you know, to show the this style. And also you do the um, vertical one. We can do some vertical, uh, same way, you know, hide the tip, like the back a little bit and do not press that much because not, not on paper, you know, you pause, but not really press. And then go down, 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 down. Try to do power, powerfully, but even uh, knife. 
and then you back a little bit and just lift in the air, some things like that. And when you do, um, when you do dot, same way, same way to do, um, like the like the little, little, very little horizontal. Okay, but with direction. So hide the tip, always hide the tip, hide the tip, and then just go. But you, on the stone, you cannot go that fast, right? Cannot go that fast. So go and then lift. So like a triangle thing, but in the uh, standard style, we say uh, like the water drop, right? Kind of very rounded and you, you know, twist your brush and then lift, you know, shows lots of uh, beauties there. Uh, some things like that, right? The standard style, because we use a soft brush thing, but on the, with some, um, the official script on the metal, on the stone, metal stone taste, metal stone flavor with more, you know, like the, um, like oh, oh, only triangle, not very, you know, on other direction. If on this direction you do press and then lift, same thing, same thing. You know, same thing as you do in the horizontal one, but no big tail. And as we said, um, only one tail. Remember the num number three, you know, when you do the short one. Same way to do, but not that, not that. Big shows the tail, right? Only one shows the big tail. This is the number three, right? And uh, um, when you write the this style, the whole image of this number three, um, you need to be uh, flat looking, flat looking, um, like the plum I'm writing here and the scissors or a cut of things here is, you know, uh, compare with the um, standard style, more flat looking. If I write a uh, um, horizontal, I mean the uh, standard style, uh, we always say the square, even a little bit of trident, I mean the rectangular, right? To this way, right? So this longer, this more flattened. Um, and look at the, the sample of that uh, plum. It's very flat, it's very flat. Uh, that's a style, uh, yeah. Uh, next time I can, uh, I can post some, like the, uh, you do not know, recognize the uh, characters, but I should, can show you the, the, whole, the whole thing of the, what does it look like if the whole page, single character image you can tell, it's, it's like a very flat, it's very flat, <laughs> like the sample plum here. It's not be flattened, it's just a look, look, like, look like that, the way. Uh -huh. Um, so some characters, we probably like this feeling of um, stone, you know, heavy looking stone metal taste looking. Uh, you, you do not always want to show uh, uh, some things very, uh, just very light, sweet things for the calligraphy. Sometimes you want to show the lots of chi or power or um, um, energy looking thing for the, even the subject matter I talked about, landscape, stone, um, rock thing. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, let's do more about that, uh, plum things. Let's see. 
can do. Yeah. Horizontal first, a little first. Sometimes you mute, you, you know, the, the um, edge probably not very uh, beautiful or um, as you thought beautifully on the paper, but it's on stone, it's just a fine. Yeah, to get some feeling, get some uh, feeling of that. And any any question about the uh, this uh, uh, official script writing or with looking or with the um, how to do that? Any questions? I want to hear uh, uh, from your your feeling or uh, you have any questions about that? I, I, I do, Victoria. If you put um, so this this word cut or scissors. Mm. Um, how would you put that? Do you put that together with plum? Is that something? Are those two two characters that would go together in a painting showing, or or is this two very separate ideas? Uh, like, say, if you do, if you painted a plum branch or something, would you put uh, plum I, and? I would do. I'll, 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 I'll do that later. Oh, okay. You've got. Yeah, right. uh -huh. that's the kind of the. Um, the, the 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 phrase for that oh, I put okay. on I, I put on the uh, the uh, the character put uh, one cut of plum. <laughs> oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah. I'm I'm getting yeah. ahead of you. Okay, um, all right. Yeah, uh, we have we do have other um mesh word for uh the the cut off the branch cut off the branch of branch of uh, some some things, but I don't know I don't know why um. Uh, this is kind of the very famous uh, uh, characters for the scissors cut or clip cut cut for the plum, for the um, plum branch. Okay, uh, what, do we, what do we do is, What's this character? One. Yeah, one. And uh, then uh, the kind of the mesh word for for uh, for that for it. But the mesh word need to be something um, with the meaning uh, consider uh, consider right. Uh, One cut. We just uh, we are learning the character.
knife cutting. <laughs> What's this character? We just learned the scissors, right? And uh, here means um, the mesh word, the cut, right? Remember always center brush, huh? Carving, carving, carving. Goose tail. Shows different from seal script. <laughs> More vivid. So it's later than the seal script. So, uh, one cut, one branch of uh, plum blossom branch. This is very famous. Um, I don't know, because it's the uh, one, uh, the, the earliest uh, flower, even in winter in uh, traditional Chinese, not talking about the um, the uh, the warm the warm house the warm house uh, today, but in the um, not 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 natural um, I mean situation, this is the uh, uh, um, I mean early earliest flower in the whole year, and the people uh, very very cherished about it, like the. Uh, the looking in your camera or on your painting, probably not the whole tree, it's just the, the branch. Uh, and uh, mm, very hard, uh, I mean, very, very cold outside. Some people do um, do the, the cut flower, um, bring it indoor. So this phrase um, is very, very um, used for, uh, for the painting, um, painting uh, subject matter. And also people, there is a sound even there. <laughs> um, and the people cherished that. And uh, um, literary painting says, oh, um, 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 plum um, with very good characters and tough and not destroyed with any other bad situation, cold winter or anything. And just uh, um, be there uh, fragrant and beautiful and uh, um, very early time, you know, uh, no matter um, how tough outside um, wouldn't be uh, destroyed, you know. <laughs> The meaning of that, the literal painting. That that also why choose this, you know, become the um, for gentlemen's, you know. So the flower, flower normally why is not 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 the lady, not the little girl, uh, but this flower can be the one of the four gentlemen's, you know. <laughs> That's the why is be chosen. Which which, uh, which gentleman is it? Is it? First or second or? Uh, first. It's the first, okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> first. Uh-huh, uh-huh. It's, like, it's I mean, I, the time, the time. Mm -hmm. The early, er, the early, earliest in the earliest. spring. Uh-huh. And then orchids. Then uh, the orchids. Yeah, but actually different, different um, area, the, uh, diff with different climate, there are some, um, um, summer orchids uh, as we did 
before uh, summer orchids, even um, uh, continue to the autumn. Yeah. And uh, um, okay, so um, plum, orchid, um, bamboo, bamboo, summer, uh, you know, bamboo. And then latest the flower consider um, chrysanthemum. Chrysanthemum. So those four all year round. I think um, become uh, become of all, the order of the natural year. Uh -huh. Not the which one. Yeah, not the which one most important. I I, I don't. I think because of the time, the order. Uh -huh. And the the plums like the beauty coming out of the the harsh winter. It's it's like a promise of spring and summer. Yes, it's, yes, yes, really, yes, yeah, yes. <laughs> Poetic, you know, just the yeah, yeah, yes, yes, yes. Yeah. Too, too too smart. Too smart because, yeah. uh, I'm going to um, arrange the, um, the later thing for the, we also have the very, very famous for the spring news. <laughs> you know, yeah. Right. Like I tell you, like I tell you after a very bad uh, uh, winter, um, plum shows, um, Plum shows uh, a little, you know, oh, spring coming. Uh -huh. Oh, that's the, for the one cut of the plum pops, uh, pops on there. Uh, uh. Anyway, so you can do some like the. <laughs> That's the, uh, very yeah, it's, a, it's called the, the one cut of um, plum. It's famous as pop song. See, that's the sentence a plum tree. That's and, beautiful. And, Thank you. That was great. Uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> so the famous and also for the um, I mean nowadays uh, at Henry shows is still um, that's of the uh, that people in Hong Kong and even nowadays people still use this term, use this phrase, uh, and still uh, very cherished about the uh, early um, a branch of, a branch of uh, um, plum. Plum. We also we are we are going to I'm going to do some like we saw um, first branch of the um, first branch in um, east east wind like the spring wind uh, first branch of spring wind also have that of phrase and also we have the you know little just a branch shows and it says. Uh, Spring news, <laughs> spring, which means means good news, means good news, and a kind of encourage people. You know, very cold in a bad situation. Um, even nat natural natural thing. Don't think about the other thing. Even even for just for the natural, you know, encourage people in the long winter. Um, and uh, in the and uh, indoor cannot go out thing. Uh let them a little bit you know fresh fresh spring things is spring news you know sometimes to do, do, do that also do that and you can put some um i mean the the um flower um blossom blo blossom uh there and better i use the uh, smaller brush to do the i always use just a one brush and sometimes oh it's too big too thick mm. victoria uh, yes, question. Uh, this is this is Mike. I I, I have a question. Mike, yeah. There's there's two types of of pictures I've seen. One is where a plum blossom 
is like in a vase or a holder. And one, it's where it's a part of a living tree in a scenery. Does this uh, phrase apply to both? Uh, 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 see, see again, I, did, I, did, I, I, I don't okay. think I understand. Uh, what, one plum piece is inside of a vase or a container, and that's an image. And then there's an image where it's a part of a tree, not the whole tree, just a branch of the tree. Is Does it have to be a branch that's actually cut or is it just a part of the tree in the picture? Uh, 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 uh. Just a part of the tree, even on the tree, even uh, okay. on the tree. Right. And uh, um, you know, sometimes a uh, very good question, not very, uh, not not the scientifically uh, has to be the cut and the, in the, um, in like a bouquet, bouquetish or in the vase that's cut. Um, yes, just, just a, a branch in my, in my painting in my painting uh, and also um or uh, in my uh in my uh, 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 uh my my camera in, in my picture uh, i choose the, a branch uh, of uh, yeah a, br oh. a branch this cutting scissors cutting this just use the um uh mesh word just the mesh word here Thank you. a branch Thank of you. things but um use this the the meaning um Sometimes you know the you choose a different uh, um, mesh mesh word, uh, not just a piece of, uh, but with some the meaning concerned. But here is just the mesh word mesh word. You choose the things even on the uh, it's still on the tree on the tree. Uh -huh. But actually, when you when you um, do the painting, normally when you do the flower, just the branch, right? not the whole tree. When you do the whole tree image, normally in the, uh, like the uh, middle, middle, middle ground of the landscape, right? You see the whole tree there, but you do not see the specific, the flower things. <laughs> you do not do that, right? You do the whole shape of the pine tree or some maple tree thing, not the flower. If you see the detailed flower, like a plum, normally you just want to do the br a branch understand not the whole tree you do the whole tree with the tree shape right not the detail of the flower flower petal thing i, I, I understand what i'm talking about well, yeah no most of them are just a partial that's right 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 just a partial so very useful for um this term and the image of things yeah um did you did you um um to do some things about the and the flower. Look at the, the um, I said the, the flower um, practice last time we did the flower. Do you still have the handout? Yeah, I can do that. We do some um, like the full thing facing to you, uh, like the five petals thing, right? We also, we did like the um, three petals of the, we say the no more than one or two uh, things. Uh, I mean, the perfect facing you five with five petals, right? Some with the, uh, the back, what about? With the back and uh, probably the small butt. We didn't do butt yet, right? And uh, I can put the, some the, like a small branch connect them. And some dot there. And uh, some flower. Look at the number four. Still remember that. I like this kind of remember like the which one which first, I mean the complete the pedal and other, you cannot see the complete one. And uh, 
some bird we didn't um, practice last time. Look at the like the number number nine is the very very typical uh, small bird. Very simple small bird, just a kind of the circle for circle it and do some stem. I mean the the bottom bottom thing. Yeah. Uh, plum, because it's early spring and uh, um, from the win winter, lots of lots of bud there, uh, and we do not know. Some might not open, you know, probably just cannot open. Um, and when you do this flower, uh, try to um, make some angle with the branch, not just perpendicular to the uh, to the branch. And look at the number 10 with um, like a more stroke about the, but you know, like this kind of, and add one more. Same thing to the, like the same thing. And this, you can put some thought there uh, even, you know, the new, new new leaves is coming or um, you know some things probably the, the bud really really small small we don't even know cannot open or yet um, and also oh the number 12 look at do you have 10 out yes look at the number 12 that one it's very, I think it's beautiful and uh, it's very useful for like a halfway, you cannot, you can see the flower center, but the flower with five petals is still not, not, to not totally open yet. Um, actually the plum tree, the flower petal, or flower part, the blossom will be this position for quite long. <laughs> and uh, yeah, until the totally five petal open like that. It will be that way um, from far. You can see just the, the, the bowl there from, from th this way for very, very long. And then uh, eventually for like that, a few days. But this position for very long. And this is very interesting. I'll, 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 I'll do one. Just do like the five strokes, uh, uh, do the circle outside the circle, circle like thing. I'll do it, do, um, do it, do it here. Uh, not, I try to do it very clear, but uh, not very beautiful. Uh, do sample on the real painting anyway. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, instead of one stroke for the uh, whole circle. And uh, do the inner five. One, two, three, four, five. You know, that's the way to do. And the dot a little bit of center thing. And the, on a real painting, you can do some things in the, uh, you know, in, indicated where uh, it's come from, you know, the little, on the little, 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 little branch thing or not. Yeah. And some things, you know, always probably two of the bottle, bottle things here. A small bottle here. That's enough. And uh, when you when you do it very, you can put some, uh, you know, I, I expand some new leaf or uh, some um, like an open the bud uh, there. Uh, add like the one more layer, you know. Um, 
I don't know. I didn't arrange the whole thing. Whole thing very good. Uh, you, I just uh, and do some practice thing. Um, and uh, for the back one, you want to see the centered thing, of course. And one more thing I want to explain is for the um, the the branch thing. The branch thing uh, from diagonally from this side to this side. Choose the branch is very common, right? But one more, um, one thing is do not do uh, the totally downward thing. Okay, um, if you do, you know, this kind of uh, things, you do try to try, try to do things, you know, um, a little bit this way, right? By, um, I mean, try, try not to not do things, not do things like that. We have the word, we have the word, the same sound with the, uh, Uh, which means uh, uh, upside down, um, upside down pl plasm, upside down, uh, upside. I mean downward. Um, we have other uh, other word with the same sound. Dao uh, mei, uh, um, the meaning for bad luck. For the bad luck. So do not do. Uh, totally like the wisteria or any any things. Totally down, down, down. But you want to do the um, um, diagonally. You know, beautiful. Choose the branch. It's very common, right? How do that? Uh, try to make the last stroke, the last stroke, a little bit. You know, a little bit up here. You know, look 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 upon. Look, you know, a, a little bit up. Not just this way. Just let you know that it's kind of hard to uh, to judge to you know to judge what is a little bit up, uh, you know, a little bit hope they are a little bit up, the tendency a little bit up, and the, what is um, totally totally down down down. But I let you know because the sound of the same sound, same um, phonetic thing meaning. Uh, I mean, not the meaning, different character, but Chinese, uh, the other word uh, with the same meaning of the bad luck. Uh, so people do not want to do the all, all the way down, all the way down the tendency for the plum branch, you know, try to do a little bit, a little bit uh, up for the last stroke. A little up, you know, a little little up looking thing. The end, the last stroke, the last stroke, a little bit up thing instead of uh, totally like that. I, I understand it because people will a little bit, people optimistic. Will, a little bit yeah, optimistic at the end. Right, 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 right. So I I, I want to explain that. Yeah. Because the Chinese uh, in the in the Chinese painting, especially for the plum, because we have the same sound for the bad luck thing. Uh, yeah, other flower no problem <laughs> because of the sound. So when the when the plum and the very very easy to do the branch, you know, diagonally this way. So, okay, but just to remember last stroke, last stroke, especially the tip, do not go to, uh, that that. Uh, no, no. Like, like the number four you were telling us sounds like death. And yeah. So ah, right, 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 right. <laughs> yeah. So right, 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 right. This kind of the cultural thing, I think. But um, yeah, better, better let you know, know, know that. Uh, good to know, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Good to know it. <laughs> and also important. That's a common. It's very common. Every people know that. Every people know that. Uh -huh. 
And the people, when people, sometimes some artists, you know, uh, by accident or people um, didn't just pay attention to that and uh, uh, try to sell them very uh, expensively. And the people, especially very um, special people, you know, it's, um, business people, <laughs> it is, uh, uh, <laughs> yeah, do not want to, um, you know, choose this kind of, even though this is art, but, you know, have this um, probably same sound. <laughs> I don't want to choose that. Uh, okay. Um, any questions? Uh, we need to do lots of the um, the 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 flower petal um, practice, and uh, I think also the characters uh, because it's uh, basically the four gentlemen and also lots of um, calligraphy strokes either uh, for the writing or for the 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 four gentlemen's painting. So we will use um, more than one a lot uh, of a phrase or words for the. Um, um, uh, with the meaning, with the four gentlemen, your orchid or uh, plum, uh, blossom things or branch things, we learn by doing uh, in our class, the characters, phrase, you know, and also the uh, the um, petals thing, branch thing, the, the, the stroke thing. And uh, of course you can practice by, uh, you know, learn by doing, uh, making cards or do you, um, not the big thing, you know, small things, a piece of uh, uh, things, you know, like one day you can finish like one hour, half an hour, you can finish things, learn by doing. Yeah, I will give you lots of chance in the class as well to do that things. Uh -huh. Okay, um, and uh, uh, today I think that's how much. Uh, do that next time. Um, uh, we'll do uh, some more things about the uh, the plum. This is the season, and uh, we have. Uh, uh, I have the red one almost uh, almost the totally the thing, but the, uh, the uh, I mean the the yellow one. But my yellow one is the not just the five um, petals. Is uh, how do you call that with more with twenty some <laughs> petals? So. Uh, and that's why I arranged the later. And I also have the red one, red um, plum blossom. My very little tree and with the flower, um, it's a tiny, tiny titty right now, like the little, little small bees, a little bit, uh, um, a little like the sesame seeds, but the wrong, wrong, wrong the shaped. Can you believe this? this cold seasons weathers survive and then they give me some the flower you know the the, the butt there uh, so it's going to be bloom i hope i pray because <laughs> uh not very not not snow not snow here uh -huh. and uh, you know it is said the flower um in, during the bud need to be very, um, very cold, need to be very cold. And then later the flower become more beautiful and the more um, fragrant, more fragrant. Mm -hmm. There is a phrase also, uh, but not, not over cold, not over cold, you know, icy cold cannot be that way, but need some way cold. Um, that's a phrase says, um, beauty, uh, uh, plums, beauty, and the fragrant uh, from the bad cold thing. You know, ask, ask people, encourage people to overcome some uh, hard situation and experience the, the bad hard situation. Then you become, you know, <laughs> more, uh, you know, uh, yeah, powerful, stronger, very encouraging things, I'm <laughs> uh, Naturally, it needs some cold things, you know, for the, um, for the bad time, you know, anyway. Uh, okay, let you go uh, this time and uh, uh, register for the, need to register for the uh, next uh, uh, series of the class. Thank you, Victoria. Thank you. Uh, thank you. Uh,